Okay, so I want to talk about how to transfer videos and photos from your Insta360 X4 camera to a computer. So I'm going to be using a MacBook in this video and I'm going to get straight into it. I'm going to give you two methods and yeah, we'll just jump straight in. So for the first method, well, before we get to the first method, we need to take our SD card out of the camera. So to do that, we want to remove the battery. So there's two little pins here on the side, which we push in and we remove this big battery from the camera and then the SD card is hidden in here which you just need to use your finger to press and it should just come straight out there's our little micro SD card I'm just going to flip the camera around now and I'm going to show you how we're going to do this method number one we're going to be using a micro SD card reader this is just one I got off Amazon which I'll leave a link in the description below if you want to get this but it's got some USB sides on it and it's got USB-C on the other and our micro SD card slot so I'm going to go ahead and plug this in and I'm going to literally slide our card in here. And if we go to our desktop, we should see the SD card right here that just popped up. So real simple, double click on it and you want to go into DCIM and then camera 01 it'll usually be and then you'll have two different file types in there you'll have an, a file type that's called .lrv and you'll also have file types which are .insv so if you're shooting 360 the insv files are the full res files and the lrv are the low resolution files so you want to drag ideally just the high resolution files in here so what I would do is I would create a, um, a folder on the desktop, new folder, just call it test. And then I would simply drag my footage into this folder and it would do its thing. That's method number one. We'll move on to method number two. So the next method doesn't actually require you to take the SD card out of the camera. You can actually connect your camera directly to the computer. And to do this, what we're going to use is a USB-C to USB-C cable. So any USB-C cable will work. I'm just going to grab mine now. Um, so it's basically the charging cable you get with your Insta360 camera. And the end of it is just this. And what we're going to do is above the battery port, we're going to open this up. And we're going to connect in. And then... Your other end you're going to put into your MacBook and you'll see a red flashing light so it's charging. We're then going to turn the camera on. Sorry, I think you have to, you have to turn the camera on first and then plug it in. Yeah, turn the camera on first and then plug in your cable. And then you'll get two options on here. You want to click the top one that says view disk mode and it'll give you a prompt that's connected to the computer. And then what will actually happen, which I'll show you now, you will get the same folder up here which essentially is the same camera and SD card and you'll go through the same process as I just walked through of dragging and dropping your folders into the destination and that's basically it that's how you transfer media photos and videos from your Insta360 X4 camera to a MacBook or computer any questions leave them below and I'll get back to you and we'll see you in the next video